Guys, it is Hershey Park opening day, and I'm so excited. They just opened the gates. All this and more coming up next on PA and J Throws. what coaster I'm heading to first. And we are off to a good start to the 2023 season. Let's not jinx it. It's already open. And an empty queue. Let's go. Guys, that was an incredible ride. Right? Skyrest, great to get back on it. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Time for our next ride. It is kind of a reality. That is one of the major rides. It's hit or miss. You think you got the beginning? I don't know which one's more popular. This or something. <laughs> I'm taking my jacket off. It's it's pretty warm here. It's like it's this is great. I, I love this weather. Alright, so the kissing tower is currently out of service, so I think we're gonna head over to Storm Runner. All right. Great Bear also looks like it's out of operation. I don't know why, because it is warm enough for it to run. So, I don't know. Man, I'll tell you guys, springtime in the park is the best time to visit Hershey Park. Like, one of the best. Besides, obviously, summer, but it's honestly too hot in summer. It's, it's, this is perfect. And I'll tell you, the park looks so gorgeous. It just looks the best in springtime in the park. Although, I do got to say with dark nights now, I think maybe dark nights might be the best time to go, but springtime in the park is up there. I don't think I've ever seen the line for Spring Creek Smokehouse that short, but I have reservations for the Chocolatier later today. Unfortunately, guys, one train operation. Wah, wah. Well, guys, time to go get lunch. Okay, does anybody know that the kettle corn stand actually 
go away or is it a new supplier or what's going on with that? Because there are two attendants right there. All right, lunch is all done. I think we're gonna head back and I think we're gonna head to Fahrenheit. Uh, I saw it was a 45 minute wait, not terrible. Uh, but yeah, let's go. Great ride on Fahrenheit, and now we're heading to Wildcat and Lightning Racer. Let's go. So, as you all know, uh, the whip got taken out. I don't know what they're going to replace it with, but I think, looking at this, this might have gotten a new roof. I, for some reason, this looks a little different. It looks like they have done a little bit of work on it. I'm really shocked that both sides of Lightning Racer are going. Usually uh, around this time, it's only just one side, but the, uh, opening day, we got two trains going. Awesome. Good job, Hershey. We're off to a good start for the 2023 season. Keep it going. So not being nitpicky, but that uh, is still Wildcat. That's not Wildcat's Revenge on the park map. But also they've renamed uh, Wildcat's Catering now to Wildcat's Revenge Catering. Also, the uh, car on the train got an upgrade. Kind of went back to what it used to be. Lightning racer all done. It's great. Uh, we're going to head back to the front of the park. All right, let's go. I'm really shocked Great Bear is not open. It's usually open by this time, but eh, that's okay. Picked up my new Wildcats Revenge Season Drink Bottle. These are really great if you uh, want to go to the gym. Uh, the day you purchase it, you get free refills, but then when you come back, you have to pay like a fee, but like you do get free water refills with Hydrate or Dihydrate.
two red stones, Sky Rush, and we're gonna go check out Candemonium next. Let's go. And 15 minutes, guys, let's go. That's all, we got a jumper. Guys, I can confirm kettle corn is still being made, and we got a new kettle corn uh, maker. Brand new and shiny. So I just talked to an employee and got some confirmation on what happened. It was just the vendor that was leaving. We got a new vendor. Let me uh, do the taste test. Guys, it still tastes amazing. I will tell you that much. All right, guys, we made it into Chocolate World. We're gonna get on the chocolate tour ride and then head back into the park. Let's go. All right, we made it back to Hershey Park and pretty much everything is closed because I'm pretty sure I just saw lightning. So we might head over a lot track. Well, for some reason they decided to close Reese's Cup Fusion. I don't understand why. It's an indoor track. So I'm gonna go do the bumper cars since <laughs> it's the only ride close enough to the entrance that has a indoor station. Not a bad week, guys. But uh, now it's the kind of time I actually kind of want to wait in a long line because, uh, well, the weather's crappy outside. So apparently Hershey Park just released a post. Unfortunately, guys, Wildcat will not be opening until May of 2024 next year because of their overseas suppliers. April Fools. It is now day two. The second day Hershey Park is open, Sunday, and I'm back here again. Kissing Tower, unlike yesterday, is open today. Let's go have a ride. Welcome to the Hershey Park Kissing Tower. For your safety, please remain seated during the ride and refrain from sitting or leaning on the doors and windows. Smoking is prohibited. Thank you and enjoy your ride. The Kissing Tower stands 330 feet high from its base to the flagpole. Today our cabin will climb 250 feet into the air making three rotations during the ride. Take in the views of Hershey, Pennsylvania, and listen to the story of how it came to be. Hershey Gardens, home to the Milton and Catherine Hershey Conservatory. Visit today and flutter along with hundreds of tropical butterflies at the Butterfly Atrium, open year-round. You will also notice some of the signature Hershey icons. All right, guys, time for a ride on Reese's Tower. <laughs> Reese's Tower is the best out of all three. All right, time for Trailblazer, my first ride for the 2023 season. Let's go.
trailblazers are all done and now we're gonna hop over the storm and let's go Alright guys, time for Fahrenheit. Let's go. Fahrenheit all done. Let's head back to Sky Rush and get one more ride. Park closes in about 10 minutes. And that does it from an awesome opening week here at Hershey Park. It's so great to be back here again, riding coasters, riding my favorite rides here, and it's just amazing. All right, I hope you all enjoyed this super long episode. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.